Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we will tell you about the 9 ways Lactobacillus acidophilus can benefit your health. So before starting, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for updates in the future. Lactobacillus acidophilus is a type of bacteria found in your intestines. It's a member of the Lactobacillus genus of bacteria and it plays an important role in human health. Its name gives an indication of what it produces, lactic acid. It does this by producing an enzyme called lactase. Lactase breaks down lactose, the sugar found in milk, into lactic acid. Lactobacillus acidophilus is also sometimes referred to as L. acidophilus or simply acidophilus. Lactobacilli, particularly Lactobacillus acidophilus, are often used as probiotics. The World Health Organization defines probiotics as live microorganisms which, when administered in adequate amounts, confer a health benefit on the host. Unfortunately, food manufacturers have overused the word probiotic, applying it to bacteria that haven't been scientifically proven to have any specific health benefits. This has led the European Food Safety Authority to ban the word probiotic on all foods in the European Union. Lactobacillus acidophilus has been extensively studied as a probiotic and evidence has shown that it may provide a number of health benefits. However, there are many different strains of Lactobacillus acidophilus and they can each have different effects on your body. In addition to probiotic supplements, Lactobacillus acidophilus can be found naturally in a number of fermented foods, including sauerkraut, miso and tempeh. Also, it's added to other foods like cheese and yogurt as a probiotic. Below are 5 ways in which Lactobacillus acidophilus may benefit your health. Number 1. It may help reduce cholesterol. High cholesterol levels may increase the risk of heart disease. This is especially true for bad LDL cholesterol. Fortunately, studies suggest that certain probiotics can help reduce cholesterol levels and that Lactobacillus acidophilus may be more effective than other types of probiotics. Some of these studies have examined probiotics on their own, while others have used milk drinks fermented by probiotics. One study found that taking Lactobacillus acidophilus as another probiotic for 6 weeks significantly lowered total and LDL cholesterol, but also good HDL cholesterol. A similar 6-week study found that Lactobacillus acidophilus on its own had no effect. However, there is evidence that combining Lactobacillus acidophilus with prebiotics or indigestible carbs that help good bacteria to grow can help increase HDL cholesterol and lower blood sugar. This has been demonstrated in studies using probiotics and prebiotics both as supplements and in fermented milk drinks. Furthermore, a number of other studies have shown that yogurt supplemented with Lactobacillus acidophilus help reduce cholesterol levels by up to 7% more than ordinary yogurt. This suggests that Lactobacillus acidophilus, not another ingredient in the yogurt, was responsible for the beneficial effect. Second, it may prevent and reduce diarrhea. Diarrhea affects people for a number of reasons, including bacterial infections. It can be dangerous if it lasts a long time, as it results in fluid loss and, in some cases, dehydration. A number of studies have shown that probiotics like Lactobacillus acidophilus may help prevent and reduce diarrhea that's associated with various disease. Evidence on the ability of Lactobacillus acidophilus to treat acute diarrhea in children is mixed. Some studies have shown a beneficial effect, while others have shown no effect. One meta-analysis involved more than 300 children found that Lactobacillus acidophilus helped reduce diarrhea, but only in hospitalized children. What's more, when consumed in combination with another probiotic, Lactobacillus acidophilus may help reduce diarrhea caused by radiotherapy in adult cancer patients. Similarly, it may help reduce diarrhea associated with antibiotics 
and a common infection called Clostridium difficile. Diarrhea is also common in people who travel to different countries and are exposed to new foods and environments. Third, it can improve symptoms of irritable bowel syndrome. Irritable bowel syndrome affects up to 1 in 5 people in certain countries. Its symptoms include abdominal pain, bloating and unusual bowel movements. While little is known about the cause of IBS, some research suggests it may be caused by certain types of bacteria in the intestines. Therefore, a number of studies have examined whether probiotics can help improve its symptoms. In a study in 60 people with functional bowel disorders, including IBS, taking a combination of lactobacillus acidophilus and another probiotic for one to two months improved bloating. Fourth, it may promote weight loss. The bacteria in your intestines help control food digestion and a number of other bodily processes. Therefore, they influence your weight. There is some evidence that probiotics may help you lose weight, especially when multiple species are consumed together. However, the evidence on Lactobacillus acidophilus alone is unclear. A recent study that combined the results of 17 human studies and over 60 animal studies found that some Lactobacilli species led to weight loss, while others may have contributed to weight gain. It suggested that Lactobacillus acidophilus was one of the species that led to weight gain. However, most of the studies were conducted in farm animals, not humans. Furthermore, some of these older studies used probiotics that were originally thought to be Lactobacillus acidophilus, but have since been identified as different species. Therefore, the evidence on Lactobacillus acidophilus affecting weight is unclear and more rigorous studies are needed. Fifth, it may help prevent and reduce cold and flu symptoms. Healthy bacteria like Lactobacillus acidophilus can boost the immune system and thus help reduce the risk of viral infections. In fact, some studies have suggested that probiotics may prevent and improve symptoms of the common cold. A few of these studies examined how effectively Lactobacillus acidophilus treated colds in children. In one study in 326 children, 6 months of daily Lactobacillus acidophilus probiotics reduced fever by 53%, coughing by 41%, antibiotic use by 68% and days absent from school by 32%. The same study found that combining Lactobacillus acidophilus with another probiotic was even more effective. A similar study on Lactobacillus acidophilus and another probiotic also found similar positive results for reducing cold symptoms in children. So that's it for today. What do you think of our video? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed watching this video and would like to hear from us, please subscribe to this channel and turn on notifications before you go. Thank you so much for watching us.